Welcome back to An Italian in My Kitchen. Today we are talking about pasta and specifically about pasta salad, which is a dish that we usually open our barbecue. What? Caesar. Which is a dish that we. <laughs> which is a dish. Which is the dish we usually open our barbecue season with. And in Italy, we usually have it at least once a week with all the family. And today we're gonna show you two ways of making pasta salad and you can choose which one is your favorite. So let's get into it. We're back in our kitchen and we're starting this video by making an easy summer pasta salad. Let's begin by taking 169 grams of cube pancetta or thick cut bacon and placing it in a medium pan and then pouring one quarter cup of water in the pan. Now let's move to the stove and cook the bacon until it's browned but not burned and the water has evaporated. When the bacon is done, take the pan off the heat and swap it for a pot of water. We're now going to cook our pasta. When the water starts boiling, add some salt and your dry pasta and follow the cooking instructions found on the package. When the pasta is ready, drain it and leave it to rest until ready to add to our bowl. Add a bit of oil to the pasta so that it won't stick all together. So while the pasta cooks, let's make our salad part of the recipe. Take 225 grams of chopped mozzarella and place it into a large bowl. Then take 131 grams of corn along with 10-15 cherry tomatoes, halved and one chopped celery stalk. Add the cooked pancetta, one teaspoon of oregano, half teaspoon of salt and mix it all together. Those colors just give me that summer feeling. Now let's get our main character to step in. Add the pasta and 3-4 tablespoons of olive oil plus a few basil leaves. Add as many as you want. Basil makes everything taste and smell better. And then go back to mixing as if you were making a potion. Now our first pasta is ready and Vanessa couldn't wait to try it. It was really good and it was so refreshing and so colorful. I had to take the plate away and take a break to enjoy it. Sorry, not sorry. The second pasta we're making today is the creamy Italian pasta salad and we're going to start by making the dressing. So take a container and pour 58 grams of milk in it. Then pour 2 teaspoons of balsamic vinegar, a pinch of salt and pepper and 3 quarter teaspoons of Italian seasoning, 100 grams of mayo and then close the container and shake it as if you were a bartender making the best Cosmo of your life. Then place it in the fridge while we make our salad. Oh, and be careful not to trip over the cut, that's an important tip. Next. Cut your veggies, have 10-15 cherry tomatoes, chop a large mozzarella or have 10-15 mini ones. Cut 3 stripes of grilled zucchini. You can find the recipe in the appetizer video we did. Julian, 1 carrot and also half of an avocado slice. Now take a large bowl and add your cooked pasta, then add the avocado and tomatoes, the carrots, grilled zucchini and mozzarella and then take your dressing out of the fridge and pour it all over the salad. Mix it all together and throw a couple of basil leaves in the mix to make it pretty. Now it's time to try it. This one was creamy and so good. It has the strong taste of balsamic vinegar mixed with the freshness of all the vegetables. All in all, I will go for seconds and bye bye. I will see you later. And there you have it. Two amazing ways of making pasta salad, which are super easy and quick, just how we like them. And now it's your turn to do them and comment down below which one is your favorite. And subscribe if you want to and we will see you in the next video. Bye! Bye.